Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss about the example 6.4, which is uh, from the chapter 6, Work, Energy and Power of Class 11 Physics. And this example is actually based on the concept of kinetic energy, which we have discussed in our previous video. I will provide the link for that in the description box of this, so you can watch that. The question is, in a ballistics demonstration, a police officer fires a bullet of mass 50.0 gram with speed 200 meter second raised to minus 1 on soft plywood of thickness 2 cm. So you just imagine this as a soft plywood of thickness uh, 2, I mean 2 cm. Okay, now the bullet emerges with only 10 percentage of its initial kinetic energy. So initially it has some kinetic energy and after uh, I mean after passing through that 2 cm distance or 2 cm thickness of the plywood, it emerges out with a, another velocity which is 10 percentage of its initial velocity. We want to calculate the emergent speed of the bullet. What is the emergent speed of the bullet? That is the question. So how can we calculate that? We can make use of the concept of kinetic energy here. See, the mass of the bullet is given as m let it be m this is equal to 50 grams 50 grams is equal to what 50 into 10 raised to minus 3 kilogram because kilogram is the si unit of mass okay gram it, the mass is given in grams here but the si unit of mass is kilogram so we have converted that that gram into kilograms here so 50 into 10 raised to minus 3 kilogram okay now it is moving with the speed initially with the speed 200 meter second raised to minus 1 what does that mean its initial velocity i'm taking it as vi okay uh, initial velocity is equal to what? Half, I mean, I'm sorry, 200 meter second raised to minus 1. Okay, so what about its initial kinetic energy? Its initial kinetic energy, I'm representing it by k suffix i. Initial kinetic energy is equal to what? Half mvi square now. Because when we have discussed about kinetic energy, we got the expression as half mv square. When an object of mass m moving with a velocity v, its kinetic energy will be equal to half mv square. So here the object is of mass m moving with a velocity v i initially. So initial kinetic energy is equal to half m into square of the initial velocity. Half m v i square. Okay, so this is equal to half into m is 50 into 10 raised to minus 3 into v i square that is 200 into 200 okay 200 square 200 into 200 all right so when we are doing this calculation 250 25 okay 25 into 2 or uh, 2 into 2 4 1 2 3 4 zeros are there okay then 25 into 4 is 100 Okay, then 10 raised to minus 3 is here. 1, 2, 3, 4 zeros are left there. So, we can write it as 10 raised to 4. Okay, this 100 can be written as what? 10 square, 10 raised to minus 3 into 10 raised to 4. Then what will be the answer? 10 square into 10 raised to 4, 10 raised to 6. 10 raised to 6 into 10 raised to minus 3. X raised to M into X raised to N. X raised to M plus N. So, 6 minus 3. 6 minus 3 is 3. That is 10 raised to 3. Which is equal to what? 1000 Joule. Okay. So, the initial kinetic energy of the bullet is 1000 Joule. Now, it is said that the bullet emerges with only 10 percentage of its kinetic, initial kinetic energy. That is, uh, the final kinetic energy... I am taking it as Kf. This is equal to 10 percentage of the initial kinetic energy. Okay, final kinetic energy of the bullet is 10 percentage of its initial kinetic energy. Okay, 10 percentage of initial kinetic energy means Ki into 10 by 100. Okay, 10 percentage of initial kinetic energy. What is initial kinetic energy? That is 1000 joules. Okay, into 10 by 100. Two zeros cancel. 10 into 10, 100. So, 100 joule. So, initial kinetic energy of the bullet is 1000 joules. And the final kinetic energy of the bullet after passing through this plywood of thickness 2 centimeter is what? 100 joule. Initial kinetic energy as 1000 joules. We got the final kinetic energy as 100 joules. We want to know about the emergent speed of the bullet. That is the final speed of the bullet. So, let Vf be the final speed of the bullet with which it emerges out from that plywood of thickness 2 centimeters. Okay, so here, uh, here we have the final kinetic energy as 100 joules now. What is the expression for the ki final kinetic energy? Kinetic energy K is equal to half mv square. So, final kinetic energy Kf is equal to half into m into 
v f square no where v f is the final velocity which we want to find it out okay now what is this k f this k f is equal to the final kinetic energy which is equal to 100 joules so we can write half m v f square is equal to 100 okay then i'm taking 2 to this side that goes to the numerator so here we have m v f square is equal to 100 into 2 Okay, then V F square is equal to 100 into 2. I am taking M to this side that goes to the denominator. Okay, so this is equal to 100 into 2 divided by what is M? Mass of the bullet. Mass of the bullet is 50 grams which is equal to 50 into 10 raised to minus 3 kilograms. Okay, now 50 into 2 is 100 no? Alright, 2 into 2 4. So 4 divided by 10 raised to minus 3. When I am taking this 10 raised to minus 3 to the numerator, that becomes 10 raised to plus 3. So, we can write it as 4 into 10 raised to 3. Okay. So, we are getting the final velocity, the square of the final velocity, that is Vf square is equal to what? 4 into 10 raised to 3. Now, this can be written as 4 into 10 square into 10 now. Okay. Because 10 square is 100 into 10. 10 square into 10 is what? 10 raised to 3. Alright, now what about Vf? Vf is equal to square root of 4 into 10 square into 10. Alright, what is square root of 4? 2, 10 square, 10. Then square root of 10 is here. Alright, so this can be written as 20 into root 10. While you are calculating this root 10, it will be almost 3.16. So while you are doing this calculation, you will get it as... Uh, 63.2 meter second raised to minus 1. Why meter second raised to minus 1? Because we are calculating the velocity. So, SI unit is meter second raised to minus 1. Okay. So, the final velocity of the bullet with which it, um, I mean, it emerges out from the plywood of thickness 2 centimeters is what? 63.2 meter second raised to minus 1. So, in this video, we have discussed about the example 6.4 from class 11 physics, chapter 6, work, energy and power. I hope you understood this. I mean it is actually based on the concept of kinetic energy. I hope you understood this. Thank you.